You might have heard about illusion of water on road on a very hot day or an illusion of water in desert even though there is no water in real. Wonderful, isn't it? It's simply a mirage. Now what's this mirage formation on road? From a distance, it seems like water is over there. So when one gets closer and closer, the water just disappears. Because in actual reality, there is no water. It's simply an illusion or just a mirage. If you want to know about science behind mirage formation, watch the video till the end. In my previous video, I have explained about critical angle in detail. If you remember, critical angle is the incident angle at which refracted ray passes parallel to the boundary. Now what if incident angle is greater than the critical angle? Definitely the refracted ray will bend further and bounces back to the same media, instead of traveling to the rarer media. This phenomenon is called total internal reflection. And it's the main reason behind formation of mirrors. Now you might be thinking, how this total internal reflection leads to the formation of mirrors. As you know, on a very hot day, the land also becomes very hot. So it heats up the air near the ground and air molecules expands. But the upper atmosphere is cooler compared to the lower atmosphere. So it behaves like a denser medium and the lower atmosphere behaves like a rarer medium. In this way, when the light coming from the sky travels to different atmospheric layers, it keeps bending away and away until its incident angle becomes greater than the critical angle. And there, total internal reflection takes place. When this light enters our eye, our eye will trace a straight line in the backward direction and creates an illusion of water over there. So formation of mirrors is due to the total internal reflection of the light coming from the sky.